I'm here in Cusick Park with uh, a very proud Tommy Gilfoyle after watching his club reach a county final the first time since 1987, I think, Tommy, uh, and a score of 117 to 115 against Cratlow. A brilliant game for a neutral like me, Tommy. I really enjoyed it. I enjoyed every aspect of it. Uh, it was really hard cutting out there. The conditions were breezy and, and a lot of rain, like, but uh, you, the, both teams produced a massive game and uh, uh, Fiekel in the end, I think, uh, were they, were they going through to the final? Yeah, Nicholas, look at you expect nothing more from a semi final because it's you know they're there to be won and the prize for the winners are a place in the county final. Uh, you know, we, we played well in spots, but credit to the Cracklow, you know, they were down a couple of key players, but that didn't a lot that didn't stop them. They pushed Fagel. I think Fagel will be more relieved than uh, you know to get to the yeah. final. I think uh, you know, Cracklow will, will look back on lots of regrets. 12 wides in the second half, you know, you just can't, yeah. you know, from from some of their top players, Reen Constantine, and Cahill McInerney and those, so I think Fiegel, you know, will be relieved to get to the final, it's great, it's 36 years, it's 1988 since, you know, we, we played in a county final and won it, and, uh, you know, I suppose any team that has come since, you, you come on after since, has always been, you know, will, will they do it? I think there's eight or nine sons of that team in 1988, so it's a great occasion. It will be a great occasion yeah. uh, for the whole parish. It has been a year of years in Fakel, uh, you know, with Clare winning the All Ireland yeah. and we having a representation on it. And you know, just the uh, the dream lives on. And now, you know, we're in a county final, and um, you know, it's, I'm really, really looking forward to the next two weeks. Yeah. Absolutely. Uh, the game itself, I mean, uh, uh, Ivor had, had his usual game, brilliant game and goals, didn't put it, you know, puck outs, everything. Uh, Adam Hogan, uh, what we expect from him. But I think Shane McGrath was just outstanding for me. He was outstanding in everything he did. Yeah, look, Shane has been our main player over the last couple of years. I suppose this year they've been kind of moving him, um, you know, in and out between the playing outside and playing inside. You know, he has that knack of being in the right place, seeing the breaks, picking up the breaks. And I think, uh, you know, again, he was superb today. I think for a small man, you know, he doesn't shirk yeah. the physicality. But again, you know, I thought ably assisted out there by, you know, Martin, uh, da yeah. Martin Daly. Yeah. Uh, Oshin Gonlan did a powerful work. And then, Indeed. you know, we yeah. got a bit of a kick off the subs bench as well. That's right, yeah. Um, I, 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 we were suffered a blow there in the, in the first half Evan McMahon going off unfortunately it looks like he'll miss I'm not preempting anything I was talking to him and, and I know nobody would want to see anyone missing the county final it's a real shame if he does but it was a big blow as well during the game to lose it, your full back like. yeah I think it was Nicholas because I think it had upset the, the marking and uh, who was going to be a free man at the back I think and it, it took him a while to adjust but um, you know look at I think they eventually got their house in order and look at Evan has been, you know, our full back for the last 10 years. You know, he has been there all through his underage, son of Harry, who won, an all, won a, a county championship. Yeah. You know, so look at, let's keep our fingers crossed. Yeah. But as you said, Hopefully, yeah. I think, yeah. uh, you know, it's, it's, yeah. it's a knee injury like that with two weeks. Yeah. And again, look at, you know, no one likes to miss a county final. And I know no better than my own son, Gary. You know, I suppose he's great, delighted yeah. that Fiegel have got to the final, but go to, you know, due to medical medical yeah. advice that he can take take part. But look at, yeah, um, yeah, you know, yeah. he'll be with them there all the way. Yeah, well, they're there spirit shield anyway, like, and have to go have those guys in the dressing room. We saw, we saw what's it, a big plus. But I suppose the one thing for Fiegel that I've seen over the year, like, and maybe over the years, is is okay you can pick out a star here or there like but they're a very even team they all put their shoulder to the wheel very physical and i mean that in a good physical way like they're not afraid to put their bodies in the line we saw that today when it was there to be won they put in uh, you know the tackles went in the challenges went in the the, the, the everything went in like so that's what fecal really bring is a, 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 a re, a, a, that's the real strength like is the, the fighting quality I think yeah I would have I would have, have thought coming into the game that there probably would be you know each team would play to strengths Fiegel you know as you say have, have, have strength and physicality Cracklow you know like the play and look at Cracklow have been brilliant down over the over the years you know yeah. they fought right to the end they kept trying to you know work the ball through the lines and just just came up short today you know they have been great each and every one of those guys 
through hurling and football, they've represented both Cracklow and you know Clare with with, 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 with with great pride. When you look at you know, I kind of feel yeah. sorry for the likes of Conor McGrath, Carl McInerney, you know, great yeah. hurlers. Yeah. They've had their yeah. day. Uh, yeah. You know, in the boys has been yeah. a great servant. The Collinses have been great servants. And then you have the Ryans as well. Look at, yeah. they'll be disappointed. But, um, you know, I think Cracklow probably a team in transition. They've brought in a couple of new guys there. And I'm sure we'll be seeing them down the line. Young Dara Neville, uh, you know, and um, um, the wing Jamie, back. Jamie Mylan. Jamie yeah. Mylan. Yeah. So look yeah. at, they'll be there. They'll build on that in the future. Yeah. And uh, tough to take yeah. today, but, but uh, they'll be back. It's the hardest one to lose, the semi-final yeah. always. Oh, but yeah. a great team. And they went it's down with, with, their, with their boots on. Today with their boots on, like, but that's you know, that's yeah, a, and they go they, again, they go again next week yeah. in, in the football. So, yeah. you know, credit to them where credit is yeah. due. They have been kind of the model club in Clare over the last yeah. 10 or 15 years. They have great work put in down there, and you know, they're still turning out their top class yeah, players. Yeah. Uh, you'll be back here tomorrow, I have no doubt. Uh, it's going to be a, hopefully if we see anything like the game we had today, like we'll be in for a great game as well, like you know. Yeah, I think I think it'll be it'll be fought like it was fought today. You know, each team knows the prize, uh, you know, the, and what's at stake. I think from a six mile bridge point of view, they have been there before. You know, I think yeah. you know they have that know how and that knowledge. But you know, I think Ina Kilimona, you know, have been. You know, probably underachieving in their in, in, in their own in their own. You know, they would have set high standards. Yeah. But I think it's about you know putting in a performance, a real gritty determination, and a bit of resilience to say you know this is going to be our chance. We're not going to let it pass. And if they do perform, you know it'll be up to the bridge to curtail it. Lots of matchups again, like there was today. I suppose Shane Amory will probably pick up Aiden Aiden McCarthy. Yeah. I'm not sure Shane Golden will probably try to curtail. Uh, you know, Davy Fitz and that. But look at Kurt, both sets of players have brilliant hurlers. You know, Jamie Shanahan, um, uh, J- J- McCarthy, you know, experienced players. So a big hum there. Relief, I suppose, in fact, we'll <laughs> yeah. sit back and we'll yeah. be able to, you know, come in and look a bit nervy today, uh, you know. But tomorrow, I expect a rip roaring, a rip roaring contest, and there'll be nothing much between the teams. Uh, you know, is, will the hunger. Of Ina Kilnamona overcome, uh, you know the tradition and uh, and the know-how. And the experience, it's yeah. It's, yeah. it's intriguing. Yeah, yeah. Which uh, it's so far has been a great weekend to hold, and I really enjoyed that game out there. I I, I was absolutely hundred percent neutral. I have great friends in Fecal side. I have great friends in the Catlow side. So to sit there and watch that was a joy, and well done to both teams. And uh, I. Best to look forward in the final. I hope we're there with you. Would it, but we'll, we've we, we kept out. We're there, so we'll, we'll wait and see who's you there. Have your so. part on, yeah. Yeah. So enjoy tonight, Sammy, and I'm sure you will. And uh, and thanks, very much. thanks, Nick. Thanks, Sammy. Thanks. Man.